Hello everyone, welcome back to TJ Lavin's Ultimate BMX. I'm in Cedic. with me again is Blank Tester. Hey kids, how's it going? And again, we're picking Fuzzy Hall and diving back into the campaign. We've gone through the easy versions of the level, so it's time to go to our first competition. We're going to the street competition, Tropical Fever. Oh, sna snap. Yeah, tip, spread it out and use the whole course. Um, mm. So it's pretty standard if you've played, you know, other games like this. Three runs of one minute each. The game will take your two best scoring runs and combine the scores together. So, you know, you can have one run where you just faff about or, you know, ride around getting your bearings. Um, hmm. As long as you bust it big for the other two. Yeah. You know. um, so, yeah, I mean, kind of a kind of an interesting layout. It's sort of broken into sections, sort of like I took the right path and went over to this ramps area. Or you could have hmm. gone to the left and go to kind of this hut with a bunch of bowls in them. Oh. That's kind of yeah. neat, I guess. Yeah. Oh, that was good. Oh, yeah, and you got the crowd in the back, like, you know, cheering you on or, or going like, ah, when you do a, do, a, do a wicked crash, you know? Yeah, sick wipeout. Oh, they're saying my name. They're saying Insetic. They went, ah, oh, Insetic. <laughs> yeah, they, they whispered the last two syllables. Insetic. Yeah. Ooh. Um, so, not a good score for that first heat. Yeah, not a good start. We're going to have to bust a big. Uh, and because it's this kind of game, it's one of those games where I just dial in and find something I can do for two runs in a row and yeah. get high points. You know, like, it's not good enough of a game to really <laughs> be able to experiment a lot. Because um, um, you might go for a spin or something, you might crash. You might literally go through a wall and fall out of bounds. I did that once in my first playthrough. You or might crash on nothing. Um, I mean, he, he took that like a champ, though. <laughs> yeah, I mean... <laughs> You know, while he was falling down, he was kind of resigned. You know, like, he was like oh, this is this the life, is the life, I, life live I live now. now. Yeah, but then he got up like a champ. Yeah. Oh, that was so, pretty yeah, good. On these ramps, just kind of go back and forth, get some huge air, you know, get energized, and then double tap some tricks. Or, if you really want to try them, go for the super special tricks. Yeah, oh. Uh, so, yeah, if you get about 20,000 points, you're pretty good. I mean, pretty much good off. You can yeah. see 96 there. Yeah, I mean, and everybody else did ass. So, yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, yeah. Pretty, mu pretty much you're going to see the same thing again. Once again, it's one of those types of games where I just figure something out and I do it. Do you think they have more than one sound effect for the audience? Uh, probably not. Probably not. You think the engine can't handle more than one yeah, sound effect? Yeah, the engine effect? can't handle it. They, uh, they put in this, you know, wave file or whatever they were using in the late 90s into the audience cheering sound effect uh, folder. Block. Yeah. Block. It's like those coding programs for kids. Where Wait, it's was like, that a 1 800 collect sign? <laughs> uh, I think like, so. Like in yellow on the left, if you turn left, you might see it. You know, I think I saw that. Because I'm. I'm pretty sure kids aren't going to be using 1-800-COLLECT. Or maybe they are, you know, when their parents aren't looking. Oh yeah, that's how they do it. You know, it, it's kind of like, you know, call into this hotline and you could chat with Elmo. Yeah, only a uh, hundred <laughs> bucks a minute or something like that. Oh jeez. Yeah. I, I always wanted to talk to Elmo. But we sweeped the rug right out from under TJ Lavin. And, um... Yeah. yeah. Fuzzy Halls. He's got the sheesh going on. He knows. Fuzzy Hall, yeah. He's a good boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So, so, now what? With that out of the way, now we can move on to the medium versions of the levels. But first, you may have remembered, in the original tutorial level, we got a key by jumping up onto that van and then jumping oh, yeah. off. And that key unlocks kind of another bonus level, I guess you could say. Oh, that's or cool. a bonus level, the Warehouse Rock. So we'll be going there next and uh, picking up some more sprockets next time on TJ Lavin. <laughs> 